you for checking out Project Moongold, PMG Crypto. Make sure you follow our socials on Twitter, Project Moongold. Make sure you look in the link in the description for our trading group. We focus on 5% to 3% risk on this channel. Join the community to be a successful trader in mindset and in trading and make a lot of money. Right, we're looking at Chili's today, CHZ, USTT. Now, Chili's ran a long time ago back in 2020, and I was a part of that run, but I was a part of the peak of the run. As altcoin season is preparing to really take off, and we get into the meet the recovery pump resistance of previous years, Chili's is coming up. We have nothing but green candles. So if you're part of the Chili's fam, make sure you do join our live Monday, 9 p.m. CST, Wednesday and Sunday. And uh, launch the PMG app, download it, all right? PMG Trading It is our official app. We're going to look at Chili's worst case scenario, best case scenario, where to take profit and where to dollar cost average if you're already in it, where to get out of the way. Now, keep in mind, Bitcoin is the king, the queen, the revolutionizer, and the creator. So we're looking at a monthly channel here on Chili's because I want everybody to make note of how important this chart is right now there's a lot of coins trending right now and chili's has not been on any list i've been looking at so we're going to be the black sheep of the pack and do a video on chili's because a lot of profit is coming all right so there was some major news i'll show you guys at the end of the video stay tuned make sure you guys watch the whole video i'll do a short-term target and where to get in but again you've got a major trend line here in the monthly now, anytime a crypto breaks a monthly trend, guys, you're looking at a massive explosion. Now, I know the thumbnail looks a bit clickbaity, but it definitely isn't. All right. So Chili's is in a huge falling wedge on the monthly time frame. And this is a Binance spot chart. All right. And you can see it is trying to break. Right. We've got three days left. It is trying to break. Our nine year 21 have not crossed yet. So we want the 9 and the 21 to cross. Um, if we throw up our, uh, we already have our alligator indicator up. So we want the 9 and the 21 to cross. And if it does, massive, massive explosion. You can see based on the channel, the trend is your friend. You can see Chili's, kid you not, doing something like this in the bull market. Now we know, and we are in a bull market, but I mean after pre having. We know nothing is exploding forever to the moon. You know, some coins do. There are God candles, right? But it is going to do something like this. Up, down, up, down, sideways, sideways, up, down, consolidate, pump, down, down, sideways, and move up. So even if Chili's goes sideways for a year at about 32 now your next target is $1.75. Now your next target is $2.90 plus. So is a $10 Chili's token irate? And is that a crazy price prediction? I don't think it is because we are breaking a major falling wedge on the monthly. Okay. And you've got massive resistance right here. I get that. So this would be your first target. But even if this is your first target, you're still looking at 800%. Now, things don't go up forever. And this is Chili's doing a magical, you know, altcoin season pump. You're looking at about 10x plus, way more than a 10x. But because the monthly does take six months to a year to a half a year, or sorry, to a year and a half, we want to look at the short term scenario. First, I do want to note is in that falling wedge, you can see your eight week starting to move up here on your stochastic momentum oscillator. What this means is for another month and 27 days, you're on an uptrend. You can also see here that you're above your RSI SMA on the eight week. So we're going to look at our weekly here. And this is where you want to look at Chili's. So on the weekly, we have just touched the top of the 70 on your RSI. It is 4.44 in the morning, guys. Crack of dawn. Give me a break if I stutter a bit, all right? 
uh, but you're at the top of the RSI. Anytime you're above the RSI, you're bullish. Anytime you're below the 50, you're bearish. So above 50, bullish, below 50, bearish. All right, so Chili's is about to have a golden cross happen on the weekly time frame here. You're 55, you're 200. It's not an official golden cross. Normally, it is the 50 and the 200. However, I like using the 55, all right? So we're going to look at these areas here, broken, right? Back tested. All right. So now you're looking at next resistance really around this wick around 018 to about 17. The last time Chili's touched the top of the RSI, we had an explosion of a run, and that was back in 2021 to 2020, 2021. We went up 6,000%. All right, now I'm not saying Chili's it's going up 6,000% tomorrow, but there is definitely a move coming here. So you're at the touch of the top of the RSI. So Chili's it's going to be on an uptrend for the next six days, roughly. You are above your three-day 200 EMA, all right? You've got your take profit in the short term, roughly between 14.4. And then you're looking at realistically 18. This wick right here, this wick is the short term take profit. This is what market makers are going to go for. That 17.7 to 18 cent wick. All right. Building a position. I've been building a position on Chili's. If you are in our trading group, you are most likely in Chili's before it popped off. All right, we are now above our 800 EMA. This is forming a massive rainbow golden cross on the daily. The move hasn't even happened yet. Your 200 hasn't even touched your 800. And if you look at the last time that has happened, it hasn't, right? There was a death cross right here, but you can argue that this probably was the move right here, but you can't even see your 800 because there's not enough history. There's an 800 daily moving average. Okay, so the question is, well, Chili's is pumping. That is all fine and dandy. But for the people that haven't gone to Chili's, when do you get into Chili's? Well, you're completely oversold on your 18-hour right here, right? Completely oversold. If you go to your four-hour time frame, you most definitely have broken out. And we haven't even touched the top of the, you know, the 70 on the RSI. You have got uptrend here so really what you're waiting for you are waiting for chilies to break this resistance right here because you never want to buy the pump i'll never tell anybody to buy the pump again non-financial advice do your own ta with my ta back test it remember everything follows bitcoin even though bitcoin is dumping right now bitcoin is dumping right now and chilies has been or was dumping Right, red, red, red. And Chili's has been pumping and going against the, the dump. All right. So we do have a rising pattern on Chili's, which is bearish. Definitely. But based on the higher time frames, Chili's is looking really, really good. So again, where I would get into it personally myself is at the break. And then you're going to take profit around that 14.4 target. Now, another thing Chili's can do is it can range. So you had that big pump here, kind of doing nothing, ranging a bit, right? The fifth, the five minutes dropping. So Chili's could go sideways for a bit, pick up a bit of momentum, break out, and then explode. All right, but based on the weekly, this is just getting started. You're very early into the Chili's pump. All right, even your eight day, if you look at your eight day, eight day is a very prominent time frame. Everything is completely overbought on the Bollinger Bands, which is fine. But the eight day time frame is not touching the top of the RSI yet. All right, it is right here. The 10 day time frame, another very prominent time frame, is not touching the top of the RSI yet. It is right here. Okay, so you are really looking for 18 and ultimately about 30 cents on Chili's in the short term. Now, are you a Chili's holder? 
Have you heard anything about Socios? Have you ever heard anything about PSG, the validator? All right, big news that's happening in Chile, guys. Not a lot of people are talking about it. Nobody is talking about it. So wouldn't it be the black sheep there? Um, guys, join our trading group. It is link in the description. You got to sign up for the app first. It is completely free. We have a Bitcoin section. We have a YouTube live section. We have an altcoin section, general chat, completely free. PMG trading by Club Limitless Inc. All right. Say hi in the general chat. We uh, are trading signals. All right, we're crushing the Chili's trade right now. Make sure you set stop losses and profit. But this is, this is looking good. There's that wick right there. We're aiming for 18 to 17. Seven. All right, let me know if you have Chili's or any of the fan tokens. And uh, let me know if you ever made money on Chili's in the past. And will you be buying Chili's? Big move coming, fam. All right. Now, again, you got to watch the market, set your stop losses, but I'll be updating more Chili's videos in the future. Have a great day. Oh, and follow Project Moon Gold, PMG Crypto on Twitter and TikTok, PMG Crypto. Make a TikTok account. All right. Welcome to the fam if you're new. All right. So we are going to hop into Chili's, uh, the Twitter here. Introducing Chili's Chain Tokenomics 2.0. Featuring a gradually decreasing annual inflation rate and perpetual token burn mechanism. All right, they got a hackathon coming up. So Paris Saint Germain begins Web3 Drive as the new blockchain validator for Chili's. PSC, PSG said it plans to become a network validator for the Chili's chain. That is absolutely huge. That Paris Saint Germain is going to be a new node validator for Chili's. All right, this is absolutely massive, guys. And you could look at the more partnerships that Chili's has. Another one is with Korea K League. We are excited to announce our partnership with the Korea Professional Football League. This partnership includes all game scored balls to be secured and presented to the fans, K League becoming a validator for the Chili's chain. And K-League Fantasy will use Chili's chain. There's massive things coming up on Chili's and massive money coming into the market on Chili's as well. So definitely, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll keep updating you guys.